the and this is the kind of problem that, that me and, this is the kind of problem that me and third positionists and Nat Sox agree on is you have to have some kind of firm stance on not allowing your economy, your land, your people, your trade to even be opened up to the influence and theft of extranational forces and entities. So Precisely. that's why that's why I'm not a true libertarian. I can never be because I, I think that then then you just get the same problem we have now, but worse, because then you don't have governmental and military protections. You have to rely on your own money and resources for all that, which a cabal of people, whom I won't name due to the size of their hats, could easily employ and use your own forces against you in that situation. That's why you have to have some kind of not-for-profit defense force and organization to your nation, or you're always going to be opened up for the for the things that will lead to the problems we have now. Well, exactly. The military is basically the ultimate defense. It's the ultimate sign of power. Mm -hmm. But it's meant to be a defensive mechanism, not necessarily an offensive mechanism. But certain countries don't quite understand that concept. Meh. I like my big stick. Oh, for sure, for sure. But I, I like the, uh, I like the, I, I like the titanium fist with with velvet gloves, soft enough to stroke a man's neck, but this, but have the crushing power to crush their neck. Fair enough. And I think that's All a good right. point to move on to something else.